Well, there's a new sport around Hampton Roads these days. Well, actually, it's maybe the oldest sport in the world. Hurling has existed for over 2,000 years, but lately it attracted the attention of a couple from Hampton who decided to give it a shot. And Nathan Epstein joins us tonight with that story. Nice crisp passes. They call it the fastest game on grass. Time! Time! Nice! It's called hurling. The national game over in Ireland, it predates just about every other sport. It's a mix of lacrosse, it's a mix of field hockey, soccer, a little bit of golf. If uh, soccer, hockey, and rugby had a baby, it would be hurling. <laughs> No hands unless you're passing. Easy passes to the open guy. No pads and full contact. It's a man sport. <laughs> it's a man's man sport. Yeah, it's very aggressive. Um, you can get injured very easily. Um, and like you said, all you have is a helmet and that hurley to protect you. This is called the hurl or the hurley. This is called the slitter. And there's actually more than one way to score in this game. Every goal is three points and every time you get through the upright is one point. All right, guys, get water. Ryan Norman has been playing for the last 13 years. I'm gonna swing for a point. He's enjoyed the game so much, he started the Hampton Roads Hurling Club along with his wife, Rebecca. We started in 2009, uh, hitting around. The first practice, my wife was pregnant with our daughter. And they just wrapped up their first full season. Last year, we probably tripled our numbers from about 10 to 30. It's been a lot of hard work and a lot of effort and you know, a lot of not doing other things we might want to do. To have had our first successful league season under our belts is immensely gratifying. The new league only consisted of two teams over the spring, but they're hoping to have four teams when the fall season starts. And that's what I like to see. In Hampton, I'm Nathan Epstein for the Sports Wrap.